My name is Ursula Minizewski. And I'm Marco Raffinelli. And we represent the Cabrera Working Group's Water and Sanitation Solution. The global water and sanitation crisis affects billions of people around the world. This crisis has a devastating impact on the residents of informal settlements, otherwise known as slums. One in five children in Cabrera, an informal settlement in Nairobi, dies before the age of five due to the lack of access to adequate sanitation and safe water. Millions of dollars have been invested in addressing the water and sanitation crisis, and yet models of effective, sustainable delivery still do not exist, largely due to the assumption that the facility infrastructure is the solution. But infrastructure and technology alone are not enough. Our solution is a multidisciplinary approach represented by a three-legged stool that focuses not just on building the facilities, but rather on improving health outcomes and sustaining operations through a framework that integrates hygiene, governance, and business planning. We'll start with the seat of the stool that represents the facility. This includes the infrastructure and the best technologies for waste removal, water storage, and water purification. Examples of these technologies include water catchment systems, biogas, and gravity-fed leach fields. But technology and infrastructure alone are not enough. The first leg of our stool represents good governance, which includes collaboration between actors from the public and private sector. The second leg of our stool represents business planning, which enables sustainable management. The facility provides a platform for health and hygiene training, thus increasing demand and promoting positive health outcomes. Gender issues, cultural context, community engagement, and communication and training represent the rungs of our stool and reinforce the effectiveness of our solution. The interaction between all the stool components results in sustainable operations and improved health. So how do we apply this model in the field? Let's translate it into an operational process that has practical application, which we call the Thamani model. The actors in this process include the funders, the implementers who build the facilities and manage the overall process, the facility managers who oversee the day-to-day -day facility operations, and the community members who are the facility patrons. In this model, value in the form of resources, information, and social capital flows down the chain, then back up it. For instance, implementers are responsible for providing resources, oversight, and training to the community operators of each facility. This process creates a self-learning operating model that ensures long-term sustainability. Solutions to the water and sanitation crisis exist. Our multidisciplinary model has the potential to deliver those solutions to the people who need them. 